Dressing as a woman full-time is a decision that many transgender women and crossdressers make at some point in their lives. It can be a way of expressing their true identity, exploring their femininity, or simply enjoying the freedom and joy of wearing women's clothes. However, dressing as a woman full-time is not always easy or straightforward. It requires a lot of planning, preparation, and courage to face the challenges and opportunities that come with it. In this video, we will explain what it means to dress as a woman full-time, why some people choose to do so, what are the benefits and challenges of doing so, and how to deal with the social aspects of dressing as a woman full-time. Whether you are a transgender woman, who wants to transition to living as a woman full-time, or a crossdresser who enjoys dressing as a woman occasionally or regularly, this video will help you achieve your goals and feel more confident and comfortable in your own skin. What does it mean to dress as a woman full-time? Dressing as a woman full-time means wearing women's clothes all the time, or most of the time, regardless of the situation or occasion. It does not necessarily mean that you have to wear dresses or skirts every day, or that you have to follow the latest fashion trends. It means that you choose clothes that reflect your feminine identity, personality, preferences, and mood. Dressing as a woman full-time also means that you present yourself as a woman in other aspects of your appearance, such as your hair, makeup, jewelry, shoes, bags, etc. It means that you pay attention to the details that make you look more feminine and attractive, such as your posture, gestures, voice, smile, etc. Dressing as a woman full-time does not mean that you have to undergo any medical or surgical procedures to change your body or sex characteristics. It does not mean that you have to identify as a woman or use female pronouns. It does not mean that you have to change your sexual orientation or relationship status. It means that you have the right to express yourself in the way that makes you happy and comfortable. Why do some people choose to dress as a woman full-time? There are many reasons why some people choose to dress as a woman full-time. Some of them are. They are transgender women who feel that they were born in the wrong body and want to live as their true gender. They are crossdressers who enjoy wearing women's clothes for fun, pleasure, relaxation, or escape from stress. They are gender non-conforming people who do not identify with either male or female gender norms and want to explore their gender fluidity. They are curious people who want to experiment with different styles and expressions of femininity. They are artistic people who use dressing as a woman as a form of creative expression or performance. Whatever the reason, dressing as a woman full-time is a personal choice that should be respected and supported by others. It is not a mental disorder, a fetish, a phase, or a sin. It is a valid and beautiful way of being yourself. What are the benefits and challenges of dressing as a woman full-time? Dressing as a woman full-time can bring many benefits to your life, such as. It can make you feel more authentic, happy, and fulfilled. It can boost your self-esteem, confidence, and self-love. It can enhance your appearance, attractiveness, and sex appeal. It can expand your horizons, experiences, and opportunities. It can help you connect with other like-minded people and communities. However, dressing as a woman full-time can also pose some challenges, such as. It can be expensive, time-consuming, and stressful to maintain your feminine appearance. It can be difficult, risky, and painful to change your legal documents, name, or sex marker. It can be dangerous, scary, and hurtful to face discrimination, harassment, violence, or rejection from others. It can be complicated, confusing, and emotional to deal with your family, friends, partner, or children's reactions and expectations. It can be lonely, isolating, and depressing to feel misunderstood, judged, or excluded by society. Therefore, dressing as a woman full-time requires a lot of courage, resilience, and support. It is not something that you should do impulsively or without careful consideration. It is something that you should do only if you are ready and willing to face the consequences and embrace the rewards. How to deal with the social aspects of dressing as a woman full-time. Dressing as a woman full-time is not only about changing your appearance, but also about changing your interactions with other people and society. Dressing as a woman full-time can affect how you are perceived, treated, and accepted by others. It can also affect how you perceive, treat, and accept yourself and others. Therefore, dressing as a woman full-time requires some social skills and strategies to deal with the challenges and opportunities that come with it. Here are some ways to deal with the social aspects of dressing as a woman full-time. Be confident and comfortable in your own skin. One of the most important social skills to dress as a woman full-time is to be confident and comfortable in your own skin. 
Confidence and comfort are not something that you have or don't have, but something that you can develop and improve. You can be confident and comfortable in your own skin by embracing your femininity and celebrating your uniqueness. You can be confident and comfortable in your own skin by ignoring negative comments and criticism from others and focusing on the positive feedback and compliments. You can be confident and comfortable in your own skin by surrounding yourself with supportive people and communities who accept you and encourage you. Be respectful and mindful of other people's feelings and opinions. Another important social skill to dress as a woman full-time is to be respectful and mindful of other people's feelings and opinions. Respect and mindfulness are not something that you expect or demand from others, but something that you give and receive from others. You can be respectful and mindful of other people's feelings and opinions by educating yourself and others about transgender and cross-dressing issues. You can be respectful and mindful of other people's feelings and opinions by following the etiquette and norms of different settings and cultures. You can be respectful and mindful of other people's feelings and opinions by respecting the privacy and boundaries of other women. Dressing as a woman full-time is finding your own style and expressing your personality through your clothes. There is no one right way to dress as a woman. There are many different styles and options that you can choose from. You can be elegant or casual, trendy or classic, sexy or modest, feminine or masculine, or anything in between. The key is to find what suits you best and makes you feel good. Dressing as a woman full-time is a personal choice that can bring many benefits and challenges to your life. It can make you feel more authentic, happy, and fulfilled. It can also make you face discrimination, harassment, violence, or rejection. It can also make you learn new skills, experiences, and opportunities. It can also make you grow as a person, a woman, and a human being. The legal aspects of dressing as a woman full-time may vary depending on where you live, what laws apply to you, and what resources are available to you. If you have decided to dress as a woman full-time, or are thinking about doing so, we hope that this video has provided you with some useful tips and information on how to do it successfully and enjoyably. Remember that dressing as a woman full-time is not a destination, but a journey. A journey that is unique and beautiful for each and every one of you. We hope you found the information helpful. We know that being transgender can be a difficult journey, and we want to do our part to make it a little bit easier. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel. It would mean the world to us. You can also support our work by joining our membership. This will help us continue to create content that is helpful and supportive for the community. Thank you again for watching, and we hope to see you next time.